Hello everybody. Well, I made a video a few weeks back called uh, Yellow Bamboo Grove. And I was reading through the comments and I, I saw someone uh, mention, sorry I don't remember who it was, uh, suggested that I go up and uh, walk beneath the yellow bamboo. So I thought I'd do that today. It's, uh, in the video, I, I described the bamboo grove as being on a precipitous slope. It may not be as vertical as I thought, but it's still pretty, pretty high. I've been climbing now through this stuff. Basically, uh, I'm on an animal trail right here. Sometimes you can find these in the woods. These little uh, tracks like this. Probably not human-made. Probably sheep and boars and bears and other animals like that use it. And I think I've spied the uh, grove that I'm after. This uh, deadfall, this bamboo and stuff is a bit of a tangle in the way. But if we look through the trees here, we can see the uh, yellow beyond. It's about three weeks since I uh, filmed the yellow bamboo video, but can you see the yellow there? Beyond there, it's still yellow. Hard to get it to focus, there we are. So I'm gonna head up there now and see if we can get under that. Come along if you, uh, if you're game. Well, I had to go around a uh, waterfall to get to this point. I descended back down to the stream. It's um, leveled off here above the falls. Very nice. Now this is the kind of place that you have to exercise a little caution. Whoa! Um, a nice uh, meadowy stream-like area like this would be a great place to see a boar. Sometimes uh, I find there are uh, there are wallows in the mud in places like this. <clears throat> Let's uh, hop, skip, and jump across. Hop, skip, kind of. <laughs> and we'll stop on a boulder of flowers. Isn't that nice? And the stream here. Oh, lovely pool. Let's go have a look at this pool, shall we? Quick sugar. Ooh, this is nice. Wow. And across we go. Look at that. Coming down through here. Let's creep under here. Wow. Now there's a, uh, a waterfall coming down or a cascade coming down from there. That's where the bamboo grove is up there. So I'm going to have to uh, push back up into this tangle. Maybe I'll course along up here and see if we can find that grove. Very, very nice place. All right, let's go. Well, uh, getting ready to cross the stream, I uh, came right over here to this far spot just to have a look at what was here. And I, th I found a place where I could have a window through the trees and to see the yellow grove beyond. You see it up there? Past all these uh, groping, reaching branches and the uh, lone bamboo uh, pole. The, uh, canopy of yellow, yellow and green above. Isn't that nice? Oh, look at that. What is that? Is it cedar? I mean, not cedar, but maple. Japanese maple, maybe, right there. I'll have to come back and check this out in uh, the fall. I see uh, insects. Very nice. Look at that. Oh, wow. I can see the bamboo swaying above. Oh, look at that. Goodness. Wow. Okay, I really need to get up there and get under that. Wow. It's like just like a yellow background there. Let's go see. So I've uh, run across what probably doesn't come through in the video, yet is nonetheless a uh, a nearly sheer wall here. Uh, it probably doesn't really come across. Look at the uh, this tree here, that creep effect causing it to come out in a stark angle like that. I mean, you have to crawl up and then clamber over those roots. Look at that. I mean, it's it's really, really dense. Now, once I get up by the uh, forest, it won't be so bad. Here's a nice snail. Isn't that pretty? Have a look. Now I'm going to make it, I'm going to try, I think I'll get around over here and go up this way, try to go around through these roots. I'll need to put the camera away. This is going to be some rough climbing. Here we go. Well, I just uh, came around this uh, rock face here. I'm holding onto this root that seems to be 
doing a pretty good job. It's starting to get bamboo up here. Uh, it's still uh, pretty, uh, very steep. What I wanted to stop the camera for for a moment was to tell you about the uh, smell. Ah, it's a little slide down there. Um, I came around this corner and I, I, I got a whiff of something really pungent that reminded me of skunk. And I've never heard of skunks being in Japan. I don't think they're here. But I used to smell them a lot in, the, in California. It's kind of past now, real pungent smell. Not, not unnatural, it smelled natural, but very curious. Look at the bamboo leaning over here. And we passed that leaning bush right there. Oh, over there, whoa! <laughs> Don't let go! <laughs> My feet give out. Okay, let's go, we're headed up that way. Well, I've arrived. I'm in the uh, bamboo grove now. I'm tired. That was a hard climb. Sometimes uh, when I'm exploring, I come to places that are uh, perplexing in that they uh, seem to demand something more than I can uh, offer. Um, it's almost like uh, if I had a little more knowledge, or a little more experience, or a little, a little more uh, capacity and ability. Um, there's an opportunity waiting to uh, be had, and uh, something uh, significant to be taken away. I uh, so often feel like when I'm in these places, so uh, incapable of doing so. I'm going to leave the uh, tripod behind for a second. Let's do some uh, freehand climbing. I got in, I saw a comment and I, I answered it uh, about uh, uh, climbing in places like this. And if it's easier to climb in forests when there's the bamboo around, and it is, watch. This is how you do it. You grab on and you swing. And you've got places the, the soil tends to be uh, soft and mushy. I'm going to leave my tripod here. And oh, here we go. Oh, sure. Places that put your foot. Uh, swing up. Careful of the uh, dead things like this. Those will break off and leave you falling. You can swing up. Swing up. Swing up. Up. Here, it's really steep. This is like a stairmaster through here. Look at this. Ah, mossy wall. Oh, sure. Coming to a flat spot here. Swing, swing, swing. Uh, uh, and I've reached a plateau of sorts. 
Look at the uh, yellow up there. Then go swing, <coughs> push through, Wah! fall back, up, up, up. It helps to have two hands free. <laughs> Ow. Ah, there's rotted bamboo there. Watch out for the rotted bamboo. Ooh, there's a cliff face over here. Check this out. Hold on here. Whew, I am all my weights on that. Sit a little bit on the feet. That is a uh, vertical wall there. Open slope. And I got the yellow canopy above. Gosh darn it. So I can't, oh, so I can't fathom. Ow. The mysteries of these places. Gosh darn. Oh, this is really steep. This is <laughs> near vertical. Big boulder right there. Oh. So I can't fathom the mysteries. I can nevertheless run wild in them and taste the the nectar of the way. Wow. Oh no. Put your spot. Oh. Are you my job? Oh. Got through. Okay, so you gotta watch out for these dudes here, these deadfalls. It seems like these are trails here. They're kind of like terraces. They're not natural. I mean, they're not man made. They're natural. I see these a lot. I think they come from old animal trails. And like, I hear water falling. I think we're approaching a waterfall. Whoa! There's a big dead rock of bamboo. Now leaving such a calamity in the forest, crashing and smashing all about this I'm doing certainly is not the softy papa approved method of exploring. Calm and quiet, but sometimes the spirit just engages you and you have to jump because you hear a waterfall. And it's I had no idea there was a waterfall here. Here we go. Hold on. Tight. Ooh. Ow. Do a couple little skin there. Now, this is a lot easier when you have two hands. Three. Oh, someone's poop. A waterfall. Check it out. Now, that's, I'm not going to be able to get down there. You have to know your limit. Well, maybe I could. Oh, these bamboo are nearly dead. Rattle and hum, crackling. The spirits of these woods, I'm not a spiritual guy, but sometimes you can't resist the urge and the, the need to uh, invoke their name. Here's this bamboo's falling over. Okay, I'm gonna make it down here. Oosh! Waterfall. Oh man! Just goes on and on. <sighs> Shh, look at this deadfall. <sighs> For me, what I can't, what I can't uh, apply in in brain power, I can release sometimes in this like this coiling rope around to this vine, coiling and coiling up. <sighs> I can release in the best manner that I know how. Some energy, which uh, makes up in uh, endorphins what I'm lacking <laughs> in smarts. Hey, I like that idea. Now that is a serious deadfall. That would have been really hard to get to this waterfall by the waterway if I had not come up to examine that bamboo force. I never would have found this waterfall. Wow! Wow! Okay, double rainbow. What does it mean? Here I am, double rainbow guy again. But this really looks special. Guys, we may be on the verge of one of my best waterfall finds ever. We gotta crash through this first. We'll just squeeze our body through here. Now don't do this in the deep of summer, because this is where the giant hornet nests are. Oh. My goodness, you're not going to believe this when you see this. Oh. Um, I'm bleeding now, but it's worth it. 
over this log. Do not do what I'm doing right now. In the summertime, do not beat on a big dead log like this. Because the, the hornets have their nest in there. But I know I'm saying that. Holy, but Jesus. Is there a wildness in my eyes? Is there a passion? It better be, because this is incredible. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Show us the damn waterfall, right? Okay, Salty, here we go. Okay, we'll start down here. This one's a big one. I'll just shut up for a moment, turn the camera on, and let it go. Here we go. Look at how it comes over that precipice. Gotta hold the camera steady. Now with it about the tripod. Looks like there's still more waterfall above. You see the splashing? I think there's further waterfall. Wow, that's immense. That's got to be 200 feet, maybe. Wow. Ugh. Okay. Oops, that cost me some scraped up skin there. All right down below, I lost some skin there. Not too bad, nothing too bad. Well worth it. Okay, geocache is going here. We got one in the pack. <clears throat> I'm gonna call this the uh, Green Bamboo Falls. I'll uh, take the coordinates with my iPhone, throw them at the uh, tail end of this video here. Uh, thank you for uh, coming along, for joining me in exploring the, uh, the canyon below, the uh, precipitous climb to the uh, green, green Bamboo, the contemplation amidst the uh, swaying uh, Poles, the uh, appre apprehension of uh, falling water, the uh, passionate uh, crash through the bamboo to attempt to regain with passion and energy what I cannot achieve with the brain power and cognitive capability, and to finally uh, witness one of the most beautiful waterfalls I have ever seen in this area. Certainly one that uh, I suspect few have ever. Uh, 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 discovered or appreciated. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm stunned. I'm gonna turn the camera off now. Okay, I got some more, losing some, losing some blood there. Losing some here. I tell ya, my love of nature is always in proportion to blood loss. I'm sure I'll find more cuts later. Bye everybody, here come the coordinates. Come on up here, see ya. Okay, uh, one last bit. Here's uh, the uh, geocache. Whoa, big old bumblebee. Thought it was a uh, Asian hornet for a moment. Here's the waterfall right behind me. Where it reaches the uh, part here. I got this big rock right here. Okay. Close to the waterfall. And uh, at the top, 
I put the uh, cash right here. I put a note in there for me. You've got a pen. You don't need to bring a pen. And I'm building a little little collection of rocks there. <clears throat> Making a little cairn to put it on. Here's the lid. I'll put the lid on. Mm. There you go. The uh, cash is uh, hidden inside. You can see it right there. Should be safe there. And uh, protected from uh, floods here. <clears throat> Dang, this is a nice place. Man. Touch the water when you come. Nice. Yeah. Woo. Thanks for joining me, friends. I gotta go find my tripod now. Continue adventuring. Have a great, uh, have a great life. Bye bye. Don't forget to have a great life. It's easy to forget to do. <laughs> and it's so easy to achieve if you just uh, tune this. You just do that thing, you know, whatever it is. Bye-bye.